Hi guys, it's me again. Alright then viewers, well, this is it. Today's the day. And today, now, see the that, that this is now part of a 3k subscribers special. And what better way to celebrate 3k subscribers is that I get to show you my gameplays of a Crash Bandicoot demos. You know, starting from number 1 and then number 3. And Crash Bandicoot is my favourite game of all time, just to let you know. Okay, so what I've just inserted first is that I've inserted an Autumn Christmas releases demo. The reason is because it has Crash Bandicoot demo in this one. That's why I've already got it all set. Ready for later. Right, and I'm going to switch it on right now. And at least you can have a look at the opening logos if you like to. I mean, it's just part of nostalgia, really. Oh, yeah. Once again, I, I do apologise. Yeah, I forgot to switch it to AV, first of all. There we go. Oh, and I'm just going to turn the volume up a little bit. Oh, but not too loud. Right. Right. Now we begin. So yeah, as you can see, uh, we got the original PlayStation logo because on the PS2 you can actually hmm, play PS1 games in backwards compatibility of your PlayStation 2. And also it says the preview levels contained in this demo disc are for various games currently in development. Yeah, it always does. Oh, don't ask about that loading screen there. Some people say it's very creepy. And it says compilation. Right, and here we go with the menu. So as you can see on this one, it has Crash Bandicoot on there, which I'll show you in a minute. There's some other demos there. There's Tekken 2, F1, Monster Trucks, Wipeout 297, and there's a rolling demo of Destruction Derby 2. So now it's time for me to show you my true gameplay of Crash Bandicoot, the original that started it all. And here we go. Oh, and it also says to quit this game, you should press start and select together. Yeah, well, not for me, it isn't, because I'll be showing you that anyway. Oh, and that demo, however, came from the official PlayStation magazine. Uh, that comes from 1996. And here we go. Oh, don't worry, everybody. Now, I played that game before. Yeah, I just gotta have to be careful with my fingers. Uh, this is a, because this is the first time I've ever get to show you that. And if anyone starts asking if I use a, should use a free legged side prod, tripod, don't worry, I'll be alright, I usually manage, somehow, yep, lots of wumper fruit here, Yeah, I do apologise for that. And here we go on a secret bit which you may not get to do in the full first. If you go on to here, the green gem, which is like a platforming lift, there's the free extra life. So these are the only free crates that you may have not yet achieved. Because this is basically for the demo disc only. Not as a joke, right? No, of course not. And here's another Torna token. <laughs> yep, lots of one fruit if you do a combo. And here's my clever way of doing it. Now, if you're really careful, and if you try to do a middle, yet just bear with me, won't you? Well, not very clever though, is it? Now, oh, don't worry. I've done that before. Oh, don't worry, viewers, that's just a classic death animation of Crash Bandicoot. So basically, I'll have to start all over again. Well, when I need to, of course. Yeah, I do apologise for that. 
Yep. Oh, of course. I also forgot to mention that if you restart from a checkpoint, you only have to collect these extra free crates again. But this time, it's one per fruits in it this time. So basically, I'll have to start all over again because I need to do it perfectly. Yeah, sit in there, everybody. All right, everybody. Now I'm going to try again on playing this level now. Yeah, just because it's very difficult. Oh, and I hope also been practicing um filming the gameplay some whilst filming the persons. So hopefully I'll, I'll be alright with a say, but if I know what I'm doing, well, at least I've got it better this time. Just. And here we go with the first Torna token. Right, and here we go on the um on the green gem thing. Now as I was saying, now if you're very careful and if and this one is only like a demo exclusive thing to do is by only collecting extra free crates that's the reason why the full version was not included in that strange yeah well I find that one strange to be honest coming and there's only one question for this app for everyone why is it that this one is not included in a full version shouldn't it be included on the full version rather than just the demo version all the time. Well, obviously we do. And here we go. Well, that wasn't very clever. But of course, the, the cleverest trick to do is if you want to get an extra life in the middle, you can check out the um, other tricks videos that some YouTubers upload just for fun. And here we go on the third Torna token at least. And we're on to the bonus round. Yeah, now, this one's a pretty easy level to begin with. And see, there's Torna Bandicoot here. <laughs> giving you a head stuff. Heads up. And now we're back to this level. Uh, that's Jungle Rollers, anyway. And see, I've now made it to the end of the level. Now, let's see on how am I doing. Obviously, I've got a perfect gem now. Yeah, and there's Crash doing that. Ta-da-da! That sort. Yeah, because that game was absolutely fantastic. And I know some gamers really hate the hard levels of Crash Bandicoot. Well, I don't usually play the hard levels, but there you go. All the same. Right, so I'm going to put the next demo disc in. Uh, that'll be from series. That will be disc ten, volume two. But when Crash Bandicoot two was here, sit a minute whilst I put the next one in. All right, everybody. Now here we go on another demo gameplay. Oh, and I know I've already done Crash Bandicoot the first one, but this time we're going to move on to Crash Bandicoot two Cortex Strikes Back demo. Because you see, I haven't showed you that yet, and not nor Crash Bandicoot three. Because I heard that on Crash Bandicoot 2 demo, it only has one level, which is called Bear It, with sound effects missing from the game. Which is unusual. And here's a demo menu. And there's Crash Bandicoot 2 on here. So I'm going to select that one anyway now, so I can show you my true gameplay. Now, this is the first time I've ever played a game whilst holding a camera, so hopefully I'll be alright, like I did before. Now I know the left stick, mm, a little dodgy at first, but I think I'll stick with directional buttons this time. Mm. 
Oops, sorry about that, everybody. <laughs> I think Crash accidentally fell in the water. Yep, the polar bear's bark is missing. Right, I think it also works with the left analog stick. Well, I might have missed a few, but don't worry. I'll just fall in there again. Yep, see us? See what I mean? No sound effects on polar barking away. Odd. Oh, don't worry about it. I'm not going to worry about it anymore. Let's just move on anyway. So I guess that's why this level is called Bear It, because you can't bear the bear riding level. Yeah, do you find that joke funny? Yeah, because I think so too. Yeah, I don't worry about the TNT crate. They detonate themselves when on a riding level. Besides, it's not even a very good level for a sudden demo disc. Well, in the American, because they usually show off good old classic platforming skills, when you include the, the other demos. A bit like horse riding on a bear, really. Yep, missed a few more crates again. And I have now made it to the end. So yeah, as you can see, I've only missed two crates, but at least it's not too bad. And it's a good thing, I was only showing you the gameplay, and there you have it. That was my gameplay of Crash Bandicoot 2. See you in a minute, uh, for the final day demo in the trilogy, Crash 3. Alright everybody, so here we go on another demo gameplay. At this time, we're now going to be moving on to the final demo in the Crash trilogy, Crash Bandicoot 3. Warped. Oh, and the level that happened in Crash Free Demo, I think it's usually called G Wiz. I think it is. Oh, don't worry, for you. it's back to good old platforming experience. And as I said, Crash Bandicoot is definitely one of my favourite games of all time. So, as you can see, we're on to the uh, demo menu once again. I'm just rummaging to see where Crash Bandicoot 3 is. Oh, oh, here it is, everybody. Right, so here we go on Crash Bandicoot 3 Warped. And I played that demo countless times over of Demo 1 originally. So here we go. I don't worry if you I'll make sure I collect all the crates this time, because this one is easy to begin with, but it's not easy when you hold the camera like that. Obviously, I did say I've been wanting to do this for a long time. Well, I'm only doing it as a one-off, just to celebrate 3k subscribers. And here we go on the checkpoint. Oh yeah, don't worry everybody, found a solution and it's only the left stick support. Yeah, besides, I know it's a bit dodgy, but there you go. It'll help.
Ugh, that's disgusting. Frog kissing trash when trash is not a princess. What a lol. Yeah, don't worry folks, that means I've just lost a life, so don't go near a frog, mind you. Yep. Oh! Yeah, I bet that hurt. What do you think? Well, it's happened again. <laughs> right, well, it's back to that checkpoint again. Yeah, don't worry, folks. Yeah, I'll try my hardest. Luckily, it's only the last one that I'll show you anyway. Now do you see the reason why Crash Bandicoot is my favourite game? Because it has spin attacks. That's my favourite bit. Oh, and spin attacks is now my f new favourite move when playing Crash Bandicoot. That's how it all starts as of today. And I know my, my brother Tom used to love playing Crash Bandicoot 3, but not so with the other two. Probably a long lost gem or something. Shoot. Right, anyways, moving on to the bonus round. And uh, before you say anything, the bonus round music is not even included yet. So it's just the same music as it goes. Well, you're definitely screwed um, if you do this by now. But don't worry, everybody. Well, it's not very clever. Well, I'm going to have to start this level again here, yeah, because I've only missed one crate. Sorry about that. Alright everybody, now i decided that I'm going to play this demo again, and once again, I do apologise, but if I've missed out um, one extra crate, which is at the bottom, uh, anyway, but at least you get to see this bit again. So this time, we'll go for left stick support this time, yeah, because the directional buttons have caused a lot of problems to the camera, and it's a good thing I'm only doing it just to celebrate 3k subscribers. Now, that's just to be on the safe side, that's all. Oh dear, looks like um, the goat has butted crash up in the sky <laughs> somewhere. Oh, get away with your frogs. Don't worry everybody, I got it now. Yeah, it's just obviously my gameplay was a little bit tricky though, but don't worry. I know I've played Crash Bandicoot demos countless times, yeah, since I used to play that when I was younger, and now I now like Crash Bandicoot, and I still like it as of today. And the reason, the reason why I love Crash Bandicoot, because I love the way that Crash does the spin attacks. That, that Crash, that's my favourite move on Crash Bandicoot, the games.
Whoops. That was almost close. But it's not good enough anyway. Yeah, that was a secret way for when frogs and decides to go near a nitro crate to kill it kill itself. Yeah, nice one game. Right now don't worry everybody, I got it now. Now this may be easy at first, but when you get to the middle, it'll get it'll get tricky. But as long as you're really careful not to miss the extra crate, which is just underneath the, um, hmm, mystery bridge, or a mystery tunnel, if you're lucky. Yep, don't worry, Fierce, I got it now. Properly. Yep, and that way you can make a bridge. And there you have it, I've now collected all the crates for the bonus round, so obviously there's only a few more to go, and then I'm on my way to, hmm, back to the warp room, more like back to the demo, more like, because the demo menu is like going back to the warp room. So, yep, I'm nearly finished now, everybody, nearly. Now that's why I'm only doing demo first. Yeah, don't worry folks, I've now got a silver gem. And that's it now viewers, that's pretty much all I can show you on my Crash Bandicoot demo gameplays from Crash Bandicoot 1 to 3, and I'm glad to be doing it. And for this channel of mine, happy 3k subscribers uh, that, to my retro channel, and I would like to thank everybody for subscribing me over the last few years. So, I don't think I'll be doing those ever again. Well, not for a while at least. But if I feel like if I want to do something, well, I'll probably let you know sometime. But anyways viewers, now that I've finished with the gameplays, time for me to say goodbye now. And don't worry, my videos will be back to normal. So, I'll see you soon. Goodbye.